Well, there's a lot of big plays, I think. I mean, uh, obviously, offensively, we're able to create some big plays, and we're efficient on the, the third down scenarios we put them in. Um, I thought uh, I thought defensively, there was obviously a couple pretty big hits there. Princeton, most notably, had a big one. But, um, you know, all in all, it was, it was a good physical first practice and full pads from the very beginning on. Uh, what I was impressed with with our guys this morning, you know, you're in day five of training camp, and uh, – you know, the young guys can, can feel the grind a little bit the, from the installation, the, the mental fatigue you can get, the physical fatigue of, of playing this hard, this fast, uh, five days in a row now. Uh, so I really challenged our veterans to bring their energy and their enthusiasm today to this practice um, to keep uplifting the, the young guys, especially late in that late in that team period when they were going. And I thought they did a great job of really responding and showing a great deal of leadership. So I was impressed with that. I, it was good for us. Um, you know, the VMAC is a great facility. Um, um, I thought uh, it was good for us to, to get on the grass and, and to practice on the grass. Um, I thought it was good for us to get in a different element, different surroundings. Um, as we well know, it's well documented of, about how important it is for us to go on the road this year and play well. And so a lot of that played into it. Obviously, four road games on the grass this year out of five and uh, understanding how to play in different elements. And, um, played some different music for them yesterday that maybe wasn't their favorite. So it's just getting them to focus on what they need to focus on. And that's their job for each play.